This is a condensed problem walkthrough from our live streams. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. So this is question number 58, length of last word. Given the string S consisting of words and spaces, return the length of the last word in the string. The word is a maximum substring consisting of non-space characters only. So for example, for input S, we have hello world. The output is five because the last word in the, the string is world, which has a length of five. All right, so so for this one, we have to split the split the string for every space. Basically, split is a function in Python and I think in several other languages that it grabs the string and it splits it on every space or in every character or every delimiter and it gives you an array of the elements that aren't that character that we're trying to split. Right? So after splitting every space, we have to remove strip leading spaces. Basically, stripping means remove spaces in the front, remove spaces in the back, boom. So we're just left with a clean string. Uh, so after that, traverse to the end of the array. From there, we're gonna grab length of word. So we grab the length of word, right? Okay. Does that make sense yeah. a little bit? And then you return yeah. the length, perfect. We're gonna grab the string and we're gonna go, is it, st it just strip? No. S dot no. strip, something huh? like that. No. Or S equals S dot strip. Mm -hmm. Isn't it strip? Split, and then you split, and then. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, and we have to set it to an array. So we're gonna go R. We equal to A dot split on spaces, right? It'd be S dot split, right? S dot split, yes, sir. And then we're gonna go. Uh, length, we go r dot, what is it, length dot r? Um, and you could just say return l-e-n-a-r-r -R, and then negative one. Okay, return a? No, l-e-n. a-e-n, yeah. And then a-r-r uh, -A -R -R, and then minus the one. index, yeah, minus one. Okay. Something like that, something like that. All right, you want to try it and see yeah, how it goes? It. Okay. It works for this, work for, not for this one, though. So... Mm, is it not maybe stripping? Cause we, maybe because we have two... We have two... Two spaces. So we do strip. Or or do you strip... Wait, no. Do you strip when it's an array? No. No? Okay. Mm, I don't think so. Maybe like this? Also, thank you guys for chatting. I see some new folks. Thank All right, we got it. Here. We got it here. All right, Let's so we it got out. it. We got. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, fingers crossed. It. It's not over yet. It's fingers not over crossed. yet. We're still submitting. We're still submitting. Is life beautiful? All right. Okay, alrighty, life's alrighty. beautiful. Life's beautiful. This is yes. This is so. Just to explain it, right? Um, so we're given a string of uh, different of different words with spaces and we're trying to find the length of the last word so in order to do this we get the string we strip the leading spaces in the front and the back and we split it by the space right so it gives us an array of all the words for example in example one we're going to get an array of hello comma world and two we're going to get fly comma me comma two comma d comma moon right so all of the words and then we're gonna get the last one, which we can do this by R brackets minus one, which is, means that we're gonna start from the back and grab the last element, and we just get the length of last of the last element, which is the length of the string or how many number of characters, and we return it back. That's how we do it. If you made it to the end and love to support us, please hit the like button. And if you want to catch us live, turn on the bell notifications to be the first to watch. Don't want to watch a full stream? Don't worry, click here to see another walkthrough of a really quick problem from our streams.